Most of us are on Zoom meetings already, but do you know Zoom also provides phone calling via Zoom phone plans? In this video, I'm going to demo how to quickly set up your business for Zoom phone in five simple steps. Hey guys, my name is Deepak and if you are here to learn more on collaboration and productivity, then please consider subscribing to my channel. So let's jump right into the demo. I currently have Zoom free meetings plan. As you can see, there's no calling option in my Zoom client. I'm going to show you how to get a new number and enable Zoom phone so that you can make or receive calls using your Zoom client. First, I'll go to Zoom phone inside my Zoom portal. And here, let's start with Zoom phone plans. There are three types of calling plans, metered, unlimited, and global select. Metered plan starts at $160 per user, applies to US and Canada, and all outbound calls are paid. Unlimited starts at $239 per year, gives you unlimited inbound and outbound in US and Canada. Pro Global Select is available across 40 countries and gives you unlimited domestic calling within your country of choice. Rest of the things are same as unlimited plans. For this demo, I'll choose the middle plan, which is unlimited calling for US and Canada. So click buy now. Here, unlimited plan and region will be already set. Now I can choose build monthly or yearly based on my preference. I'll choose build monthly because that's what I prefer. Next, I would get three options, either to choose a toll free or a local number or port an existing number. I want to get a new number, so I'll choose local number. Next, I can search with an area code. For example, I'm in Toronto, so I can type 647 and it would list available numbers. Then I can choose a number based on my choice. You would also be able to choose a phone number during setup stage as well after you have purchased a plan. Anyways, next I can choose a number of lines. So you can choose up to 25 lines. In this example, I would choose just one because as you choose more lines, you will be billed for each line, which is close to $19 a month. And I would just want to save some money by choosing one right now. Next, international calling fees, which you would incur for any international outbound or inbound call. So you can choose pay as you go or choose some fixed pre-played plans. I'll just choose pay as you go as I know I won't be making any international calls. Once you click continue, it would ask you whether you need Zoom meetings or Zoom rooms. You can just click this step. Next, you would be asked to enter your address and credit card details. Next page, you can review the billing details and then place the order. Once you place the order, it would give you a message saying it would take around 24 hours for changes to take effect. And next, you would get an option to set up your Zoom phone and you can choose begin setup. During setup, you can select a country, state, area code, and also a main number for your company. For each user, you can define an extension number between three to six digits. For this example, I'll choose four digit random extension. If you don't want to set up your main company number, then you can also assign the number directly to a user. On next page, you can set up your address, which would be associated to your phone and would be used for emergency calling services. Next, go to phone management, users and rooms and choose the user. In package section, click assign and select the new package type and save. Once setup is completed, your user will receive an email with the extension number. And also if users logs into his Zoom app, he would get a new phone icon. If you select phone icon, it would take you to phone interface. In the left, you will see the call history, uh, then voicemail and then lines. If you have any shared lines which you're sharing, all will be displayed here. In the middle section, you will see the dial pad and the bottom you will see the caller ID or the main company number. To make a call, just search for a contact or type the number. I'll just type the number 
And if I open my cell phone, I can see my Zoom line as a caller ID. Let's now make a test call to my Zoom client from my personal mobile. So I'll dial my Zoom number and my extension. And you can see I just received call on Zoom client. You can make Zoom client default for your phone calls by going into settings, phone, and inside default for calls, select Zoom from the drop down. To, to customize settings for your phone, go to phone system, management, users and rooms, and settings and select the user, then go to user settings. Here you would be able to set business hours, voicemails, recording options, and many more. All right, guys, this is all about Zoom phone setup, and I hope you found it useful. I would love hearing your feedback in the comment section, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.